The National Calgary Museum and Hall of Fame is the only museum in the world dedicated to honoring women of the West. This right here, the ultimate ode to the cowgirl. Come inside and see for yourself. The West wouldn't have been one if there wasn't cowgirls. They would have gone back east if the cowgirls hadn't been here. Kit Moncrief knows a thing or two about cowgirling. The president of the National Cowgirl Museum and Hall of Fame raises cattle, quarter horses, and is an iconic cowgirl figure in her own right who loves honoring pioneers of the West. From curing cancer to going in spaceships, it's the cowgirl spirit. We have a board member that doesn't ride horses, she said, but she's a real cowgirl. She says they're comfortable in the middle and dangerous at both ends. So, Started in 1975 in a basement in Hereford, Texas. Today, the now Fort Worth based museum boasts 33,000 square feet, packed full of over 4,000 artifacts. In a way, it's like a modern day love letter to females of the West. This museum features absolute cowgirl royalty. I'm talking Dale Evans, Sacagawea, Laura Ingalls Wilder, Sandra Day O'Connor, even modern day cowgirl heroes like Pam Minnick have graced these halls and these walls. Oh, it's amazing. These women inspire, and then they're in so many different fields. I mean, from entertainment to artists to, to ranchers to cowgirls, they're all have done something in their own right to make them very special. Special women indeed, that Kit says are recognized for the way they live their lives, not just their job title and achievements. Somebody that's strong in their convictions, loves the out of doors and, and animals and the way of life and the freedom that we appreciate in our country. I think that's what cowgirls are. Even if one doesn't identify as a cowgirl, the museum is purposely designed to make people of all ages feel like they are part of the lifestyle. Make people feel like they're outside and seeing the ranch life and seeing the horses. So hopefully you're immersed with the out of doors and these wonderful ranches and horses and feel like you're there and, and hopefully people will wanna go there and, and get a experience by being there.